All right, Seth, you stayed on fire at the plate, three-run homer early, gave you guys a lead, looked like y'all had things rolling. Talk about that first. Um, you know, I was just looking for something I could uh, hit in hit my zone uh, through a breaking ball. Kind of made me look dumb in that first pitch. Uh, I was just sitting fastball, and uh, but uh, thankfully I was actually, you know, just ready to hit, cleared my mind, and just stepped in the box and cleared everything and just kind of reacted to that through a fastball on the outer part of the plate, and I just put a good swing on it. Three home runs, three days. I'm sure you probably would have traded a couple of those for a couple of wins. Oh, I mean, I'll trade those every every day of the week. I'll, I'll go 0 4 if we won every game, and and you know that's just just what you know. I just want our team to win so bad. You know, credit to Florida State. They played a heck of a game um, throughout actually throughout the whole weekend, and you know they swung the bats well. They pitched well when they needed to, and they had the timely hits. What was the difference this weekend? You guys usually thrive on the pressure and didn't seem to work this weekend. Um, you know, there's just a, there's a bunch of different things. I think we fought back, and uh, sometimes when we fight back, you know, teams roll over. And uh, in this case, you know, Florida State, you know, they're very well coached. And also, you know, their players uh, know they can compete on every level. And, uh, you know, I just think uh, when we battled back, you know, they, they didn't lose it either. They kind of, you know, beat us at our own game. And, uh, you know, we're, you know, getting walks, you know, hit by pitches and all that stuff, doing the little things right, stealing bases. And, uh, you know, they kind of beat us with our own game, you know, because that's what coach wants us to do and stuff. And sometimes you just got to tip your cap. You know, I said, you know, I say this all the time, but, you know, you can't have a team go undefeated. That's just impossible. So the positives we can take out of that is, you know, you just kind of, you know, you poke the bear. You kind of put a fire under our belly, you know, coming into the series, you know, with a uh, seven-game win streak or whatever it might have been. You know, now, now we, we're back to reality and we're back to square one and we're going to work harder. Um, throughout the practice and practices coming up, and you know we're going to come out and play Georgia with the best of our abilities. Thanks.